Closer to home, Mumbai cricket has for long been the stepping stone for many cricketers before they attain glory in national colours. The Mumbai cricket team has won an unprecedented 39 Ranji titles, right from Vijay Hazare to Sachin Tendulkar, from Vaseem Jafar to young Rohit Sharma. All of them have represented India with distinction. So the question we now ask is, what is it that makes Mumbai cricket so special? Well, the answer could be attributed to the Mumbai Cricket Association, which is the guiding light for many young cricketers surging ahead in their quest for excellence. Sportzone's Aditya Banerjee takes you on a tour into the world of a young Mumbai cricketer. Mumbai Cricket Association, the hotbed for cricket in India. It opens the gates to the next generation of superstars who will continue to serve the country with distinction. The Mumbai Cricket Association Academy at the Bandra Kurla Complex in Mumbai is where the under-14, under-16, under-19 and under-22 teams of Mumbai Cricket learn all about cricket. Grooming them right, that's what it's all about. Former Indian wicketkeeper and Mumbai Ranji team captain Chandrakan Pandit is in charge of the nursery of Mumbai Cricket. He is the director of the MCA Academy and is enthusiastically involved in the process. Almost seven teams are practicing uh... Uh, every day uh, from Ranji Trophy to you know girls under 19 so we have five groups with the boys the Ranji Trophy then 22 19 for uh, 16 14 with additional under 19 girls and seniors girls so women so it's uh, naturally seven um, teams are practicing and uh, throughout the day it's not for nothing that Mumbai is the most successful team in Indian domestic cricket with 39 Ranji Trophy titles the groundwork starts early. The so under 14 tournament is in February, and the other tournaments like uh, under 19 and 22, they will be starting in October. So, naturally, we require that much time. Of course, when we're talking about um, February tournament, which under 14, now under 14 is, I think, under 14 and 16 are the uh, very important uh, group. I mean, uh, as, as far as junior cricket is concerned. And we know that if we, the Mumbai cricket has to uh, looking for the uh, bench strength in the future, that we need to prepare with them. And of course, this is a time which we have that we can work on their technique and skill. The various age group teams of Mumbai are offered the best of facilities, the same that a Sachin Tendulkar would get while playing for India. It is a source of inspiration for the scores of young boys who nurture dreams of making it to the big league one day. After we shoot that player, and uh, uh, then we try and get the players in the audio vis uh, visual room, where we have a projector on a projector we show on the screen, and discuss with uh, so many aspect uh, with that individual player. And normally we work with the uh, technical aspect. So where we come to know where he is uh, lacking, what is the technical uh, aspect he is lacking, and we give them remedy as well. So there are many players when they, after seeing that uh, video. They understand uh, immediately and uh, after that session that we try and uh, take them uh, in the indoor hall and work on the technical aspects. The MCA understands there's much more to grooming a cricketer than just training him in the nets, fitness drills and video analysis. Talented young cricketers face one major issue, handling on-field and off-field pressures. And that's where the MCA comes into the picture. They train him for life. These budding cricketers are given lectures on handling pressure, captaincy skills, nutrition, the legacy of Mumbai cricket and even on psychology. All of this goes into making that complete cricketer and Mumbai leads by example. In these boys lies the future of Indian cricket. They have cricket running through their blood and there is no stopping them.